Hey everyone, Sonnyish here. We're going on a little adventure today to Blackheart's Bay. And we're taking along an interesting Zerg fella named Abathur. Um, so, this is going to be a little bit of an interesting match. Just because Abathur is so different from most heroes that we see in other MOBAs. He sits in the back of the base and doesn't really do anything. Actively, uh, well, he doesn't engage in combat personally. He either a hero has left the battle. a little a hero has left the battle. Uh, symbiote, a talent. or mm, let's go with he can create a clone of one of the other heroes on our team. Um, yeah, we're going to. Yes. Increase damage on that. I don't know if Uther's happy with our team. Yeah, everyone's kind of like, what? What do you mean, man? Oh, apparently we are playing a good enemy team. Battle commencing in. Is that what? Ten seconds. I think that's what that meant. Let's win and Five, show how good we are. Four, Aw, three, hell yeah. Two, one. <laughs> We're going Let's on go YouTube. So I should probably actually deep tunnel over here. And I'm going to throw down my mines. Doesn't look like anybody's actually coming to Illidan's aid. So this might not end well for us. Those mines did end up hitting somebody. We've got two on two situation up here. Uther needs to get back until he can get some heals on. Oh, we have so almost got yes, we just got Tyrael, and actually we're gonna get. We might get a two for here. Nope, not quite. Okay, I'm gonna go hop in. Uther. Help him out. I'm gonna hop in Gazlo here. Help with the push. Looks like uh, Tyrael's actually completely uncontested at that bottom chest. They got oh Zeratul's not. Yep, that was not gonna go well. Hello Zeratul. We have no help. Tyrael's on his way up. So I'm not sure what we'll be able to do there. Tyrael really should turn in before coming into this battle. Just turn in. So I should probably stop chatting and start helping my team out. So I don't know if we're going to be... Zeratul just up and bailed on his team. I'm going to throw down some mines. Try and help out with these chests and get back in Illidan. Before he dies, try and heal him up. Oh, we are so close to getting Tyrael. And... Oh my gosh. Their Abathur just saved him. So close. Got Zeratul and his three coins. Yeah, we're going to go Toxic Nests, gain global range on that. Cancel the Symbiote, and I'm going to throw down some Toxic Nests. Behind, well, wow, it's me cool. It's actually probably better for me to hop in a melee character because that way my spike burst actually does something so we have eight coins in and what we should do is an ally has finished the turn-ins so that's what we should do is get the last of the coins from these two guys right here they're very weak and they give off two coins so it makes it nice Nice easy turn in there. 
<coughs> Excuse me. Wow, my throat has been really sore today. So Illidan should be able to do that without much needing much help from me. And that should be our first turn in of the game. I've kind of come to the conclusion that levels on this map are not nearly as important. So as winning those chests is. So we can actually give up some of the chests. Or we can give up some levels as long as we maintain a lot of chest. Uh, a lot of coins and a lot of pushes. So this is what I mean by I should probably stick to melee characters. Just because uh, my spike burst is a lot more effective against them. <laughs> Looks like WoW is... Wow, cool, it's me could actually end up dying here. Oh, looks like he got saved, but I'm not quite sure what saved him. Their avatar's trying to put down some mines. I'm going to pop out here. And did I hear chests about to go down? Looks like Tyrael's getting in position. So I'm going to lay down some Choose mines here. Um, toxic nest slow. We're going to increase my stab range. Uh, we have no one on the bottom lane, but neither does the other team. Illidan and Gazlo are pushing this. Looks like they're going to have some company here very shortly. Yep. Because I saw the watchtower go down, and so I figured that they would have someone attacking them as soon as possible. We have mercenaries coming in from both sides. Need someone bottom to push those mercs back. So we need somebody to go down there. Illidan's on his way down there. Let's not all go, guys. We still should leave somebody top. Heal up, uh, well, not heal up, but help out Axilt here. Both chests are now out. And looks like, okay, they are oh, A-okay on bottom. Middle, not so much. We have, even have zero tool coming in on the side. Tyrael, you just need to get out. Run, Tyrael. So they have quite a few coins there. Of course, if we can just take them all back. Oh, this is going to be really interesting. Yep, they're going to take all the coins. Watch out, Uther. They're coming. Oh man, Uther got out of there just in time. Maybe we can keep these guys busy, keep them from getting turn a turn in. We might be able to do it. This is going to be super close. Looks like Zeratul just bailed. Which is not a bad idea on his part. Illidan's heading to the bottom to take out those siege giants. And I'm going to get out and put down some An ally mines. Zeratul is definitely going to try and turn in as soon as he can. Yep, there's nothing I can do to stop this right now. They're going to get those in. Oh, 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 Tyrael. Great stop. Zeratul has eight, so we really do need to stop him from getting any kind of turn in. Oh, we just stole all of Zeratul's coins. That's eight coins right there. I actually have, I did not know I could pick up coins. All right, guys, let's get these in. That is going to give us a full turn in. And put us, <coughs> excuse me, put us two shots ahead of our opponent, which is going to be a huge help. We're going to go for the Knights right now, which will give us even more of an advantage. I should probably just use the ultimate. I'm not going to be able to use it in a team fight. 
and I should just use it to take down as much as possible. Yep, see, there you go. Um, we're going to go increases charges on Toxic Nest. Lucas gain a cleave attack. That's kind of nice. And I'm going to inhabit this guy. Try and push back some of this, some of this push that they're come that they're bringing towards us. What would be really nice right now is a mule. They should just keep pushing the bottom. Actually, that's what I'm gonna. I'm gonna surrender this, and I am going to hop in Illidan down here. Okay, don't lose any coins, guys. Oh, beautiful, beautiful metamorphosis by Illidan. And we are just picking up coins left and right from the enemy. We're even going to get the second uh, fort here. Fort destroyed. So we do need to go turn in. We have actually, I think, nine coins. We have about, I think between everyone here we have, yeah, we have nine. This is going to be two more. Which gives us a total of 11 of the 14 that we need. This respawn will be up. That'll be 13. And this is going exceptionally well. I'm going to try and help out this top. Spawn a little bit. Give my minion, my little creep, a uh, shield. And it can actually hold off quite a lot, quite a while with my, with, uh, my support. So we're actually three levels ahead and doing fantastically well this game. I'm gonna keep spam. I'm gonna keep spamming this, trying to push this lane as far back as possible. Looks like my team might need me. We have the enemy Gazlo up here. Which I don't know if he realized I was there. <coughs> oh, they got mercenaries. Top. Could use one of you. I'm gonna hop in Illidan, give him even more of a shield. Oh, beautiful timing. Oh, we don't even have the chests out yet. Alright. Um, we're going to go with shielded targets move faster, just to give Illidan a little bit of a speed boost here. But yeah, Gazlo is really pushing the top. I need to hop out of Illidan and get back behind this gate. <coughs> Excuse me one more time. The enemy has destroyed a fort. Cease fire! If they want more, they better pay me. So we have one coin on Tyrael, and I don't know if we have any more. Two on Uther. Uh, Uther's not I oh he was going after our knights. Uther's not ideal here, but he'll have to do. So I'm gonna keep just trying to run make them run as fast as possible. Uther actually moves faster when I'm shielding him. Got him with the shot. And I may have to jump into one of our creeps down here to help them out. Yep, there we go. Keep him alive and push back this lane as much as possible. I'm going to switch to one of the stronger guys. Can I jump in? Nope, I can't jump in these guys, but I can jump in this guy. Oh, that was very short lived. So, looks like Illidan wants some help, which I don't really blame him. He does have Zeratul completely on his own there. Oh, he has Abathur Zeratul and regular Zeratul. Uh, Zeratul's trying to get a turn in. We need to really take him down. He has seven coins. That would be a huge boon for us if we're able to steal those. And we got them! Tyrael's trying to recover, get as many of those coins out as we can. And we got his, too. <coughs> More than enough for us to actually get another turn in. I'm going to hop out here, and I'm going to hop into 
Axel Hill, who is the one guy on our team that is not part of our little group here. So we're attacking the enemy again. Looks like Illidan is... Yep, they just went after Falstead and knocked him down. Who do I have up here that I can help? I'm going to pop out of him and I'm going to hop into... Well, yeah, I'm going to hop into Tyrael. Oh, so close to protecting Tyrael. So we gave up one coin there with Tyrael, but we actually got most of them. We even have the Siege Giants going down here. Uh, Gazlo is being a real pest. Gazlo and Zeratul are pushing here. So they're being real pests. Am I actually going to be able to kill Zeratul here? Oh my gosh, I almost killed Zeratul <laughs> with a symbiote. It's like, we're not that far in levels anymore. Okay, I do want more Illidan action going on, so I'm going to try and stay alive. I will admit, I'm not actually great with Illidan. Ow, that hurt. Oh, I just need, f I need to survive for five more seconds. And I can use... Come on. Oh, interesting. I don't gain the increased health that regular Illidan gets in this form. An ally has been slain. That's actually quite interesting. I did not realize that I did not gain the extra health. I'm going to pop into Tyrael here and help him take out Gazlo. Tyrael, you move faster. Go, go, go. There we go. And I will keep stabbing. Okay, could be a bit of a problem with Zeratul showing up. But I'm going to do what I can. I'm going to hop out and hop in this creep. So I can make one of our one of our minions almost as powerful as uh, the mercenaries. Well, okay, maybe not quite that powerful, as this one's about to die. I'm gonna lay down some mines here. An ally has been slain. An oh, has been slain. I should probably get into the team fights. Yeah, it looks like they're finally gonna An get a turn in. They just made a huge comeback. So they're going to attack the bottom here, which has scarcely been touched. So we're trying to figure out where we can make a stand. Gazlo has killed a lot of our base. So I'm actually going to deep tunnel down here, so I can be closer to helping them out. All right, Uther, stay alive. Come on. Oh, and we did get... Oh, they definitely overextended. That was not a good idea on their part. I'm going to maybe swap out here. Yep, we're going to go Evolution Master. Increase the cooldown of that. Tyrael really should get those mercenaries up. I'm going to hop out of him, and I'm going to try and push back this top lane as much as possible so hopefully they hit these mines I may have misplaced them oh no there we go oh yes much better I'm trying to do as much damage as possible but I don't know if it's gonna work okay there we go Illidan Illidan's moving out to help Someone on my team actually actually decided to help. Great. All right. Uther's picking up those coins. Who on our team has coins that we can turn in? So we really do need to use these knights to really push this lane. Mercenaries incoming on bottom along with Tyrael. 
Give Zeratul a little bit of a, I mean, give Illidan a little bit of a speed boost here. Yeah, we need to defend that gate. I'm helping uh, Illidan here push as much as possible. Just keep pushing, Illidan. Just keep pushing. Just keep pushing. Oh, Finding Nemo is such a good movie. Okay, so they're bringing a lot of pressure right here. Actually, they're bringing way too much pressure. Yeah, I need to back up. I really need to back up. Who just died? Gazlo. I really do need to back get out of there. So unless he can do that, they have pushed way too far, way too easily. Uh, it looks like Illidan is taking on... I'm not sure what. Oh, Gazlo's already out there for some treasure. This game is actually ending up being very close. We have thrown away a bit of a lead that we had. So did Illidan end up winning that fight? I think he did. Um, man, I'm not sure which one... who I should inhabit. An ally has been slain. We just lost. Yep, this is a two-on-three fight. This is not a good place for us to be. Illidan is back, thank goodness. That should make this battle go very, very well in our favor. Uh, what happened to the other Zeratul? We did not take him down. Get out of there! Watch out for the bomb. So I'm going to shield Illidan. Go for that chest. So if we get that last turn in, that'll be enough to destroy this bottom lane. And I can kind of keep pushing here. I need three more seconds. I need this guy to survive. Just three more seconds. There we go. I will inhabit this and we are 